Welcome back to Richards. Today we've got Left Hand Brewing's Oktoberfest. <laughs> Spicy noble hops with a clean lager finish. Clean. It says biscuit though, it's gonna be so bready. Uh, do you wanna guess the alcohol on this? It is 24 IBUs. 5.3. 6.6% alcohol. What? <laughs> I feel like these have fluctuated between 5 and like almost 7%. Jeez. And it's been it's been pretty wild. I mean we went into this thinking there would be like 4% of years. Um, I don't know that I've ever had anything by Left Hand Brewing, but this is obviously seasonal, and it says brewed on the banks of the mighty St. Brain, which I'm assuming is a river. In river. Uh, I can't see So I was just told that Left Hand Brewing is from Longmont, Colorado. Yeah, so shout out to them out there. St. Brain River, you're on the banks of it, that's cool. This was, oh, no canning date, but it does have a Best Buy date of November 17th, 2022. So, still really good, uh, especially if we're filming this September 30th. So, yeah, so we're getting out these out there ahead of time. But Octoberfest is in September. Right? Yeah, so it makes sense all these beers came out in September. But for most people, it's, there's going to be a lot of Octoberfest beers in October. Um, but all that being said, I think it looks like a pretty cool cam. I like the Lion Jaguar on the other side. Sure. I don't like these Octoberfest beers because I don't like the blue and the white diamonds. It's so I boring. I just realized they're on there again. <laughs> it's so boring. But I think it's just the tradition, like that's the yeah. traditional look. So yeah. they, I mean, they can make it. It's just okay. so boring. Like, I feel like all German loggers are just like so boring. Them right now. So, well, who wants to drink a lager? No one. A lot of people do. <sighs> a lot of people love lagers. It's their favorite style. We talked about this before. So, that's enough talking. Let's get to drinking. All right, it's time for perhaps our second to last Oktoberfest. Uh, what's cool about this is on the, uh, on the pull tab, they have their own little Left hand? Yeah. Actually, it's a right hand. Ah, ha, 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 we got him. Same thing there. Oh, wait, because it's going forward like this. Are you being serious? Yeah, I thought, I'm thinking it's like this. That's why I went like this. Wow. Oh, We're on our A game. We're on our A game. This looks so gross. All right, we've got that deep, dark, orangish lager. Come to expect from an October Fest beer. Your face is getting me excited. Okay, a little malty, a little lagery. This smells like bread. This smells like it's kind of just like bread. Yeah, a little bit. But I prefer this to that usual beer smell we get. Um, there have been some October Fest that we do. We have like beers that I like. Best beers. Do you like the best beers? You like Marzins. They look like gross. I like these Marzins. It looks like... Yeah, it is. Oh, okay. Oh, it is. Not as bready as I was going to be. It's still bready. No. It has a nice, clean finish. It does not have a lot of that bread you know, at all. It's still there, but it's not as... Prevalent as this is the kind of Oktoberfest I like to drink. It's almost sweet, a little bit bitter. You get those hops in there, um, and not super bready at all. I, I really like this. Oh, this one is actually not bad. <laughs> I kind of like it. I mean, yeah, I can taste the ballpoint pen and a little bit of the bread. But, I mean, for a lager, it's pretty good. Yeah, I, I think that's why I like Marzins is this right here when you do it this way. I think some of those Oktoberfest beers were masquerading as Fest beers. Mary, what do you think about your rating on this? I give it a 3.75. Wow. It's good, I mean, 
I can't believe I'm actually saying this about a logger, but if I had to buy a logger, this would be it. Out of all the loggers I've ever had, though, I don't want to like a logger. Did it? Wait, did I like Sam Adams? Better the Boston logger? Yeah. The regular. I think I might have liked that better. Yeah. But this is, I mean, this is good. I really like it. Yeah, I think, I think this is a good regular. Yeah, I've been going back and forth on this, and loggers are never going to be my style, at least not right now. I think I'm going to give this a 3.5. It's probably one of my favorite of the October Fest beers that we've had, but it's just so hard for me to give an A to this beer when I'm not I'm jumping for joy over it. I'm not like this is the best beer I've ever had, you know. And this to me is a really solid beer. This is a beer I can see myself getting again. I can. This is a beer that I sip on just like casually while I'm doing whatever, you know. Yeah, I think this is a good like I don't know, like a barbecue beer, which works for us because you know, September and October it's so hot here. But yeah. I don't know, like, it seems weird that in September and October it's probably a little bit colder in Germany. What are they doing? Drinking warm beer. They're drinking their beer warm over there. Ugh. Well, I guess they're hanging out at Oktoberfest and they're all fucked up. Yeah. I mean, this is also a good beer maybe to eat with food. I feel like lagers go well with food. I'm not a big alcohol drinker with food. Yeah. Um, but I think this would pair well with all your stereotypical Oktoberfest food. Um, this is a great beer to just like hang out with people. I don't think it's gonna offend anybody, like an IPA or a sour wood, um, or like a high alcohol stout. Um, at 6.6%, you do gotta watch yourself on these, I feel like, though, it will sneak up on you. Um, and that's cool too, because it's a, a good alcohol level, where you only need, you know, two, maybe three of these, and all of a sudden you start to feel like, mm -hmm. yeah, that's good. Yeah, I agree, I like it. I just will never like lobbyists, I'm sorry. Left hands. <laughs> um, but yeah, Left Hand Brewing Company. Good job on this Oktoberfest. Uh, I think we're gonna we're ending Oktoberfest with style. Is that it? Yes. That's it. Nope. We got one more Oktoberfest beer, and that will be next time. And that's gonna do it for today's beer review. I hope you enjoyed it. Like, share, subscribe. It helps us out. Slam that bell icon. You'll be notified when we upload new videos. Like I said, the next one is going to be the last Oktoberfest for the season. So. Who saved the last? Okay. Yeah, but until then, World the Rumors is trying every beer from around the world. One, One sip at a time. time.